you know, there's a lot of messages to get across to high school age kids, even elementary, junior high school kids and, and parents about uh, substance use disorder or substance abuse as we've known it for years. Most important is um, starting at a young age, getting that message between parents and children um, how important it is to keep the lines of communication open so that parents are always able to have dialogue with their kids when these issues come up for them uh, as they're being tempted by peer pressure in school to, to drink. At, um, you know, year after year, we see the statistics showing that kids starting at an earlier age, both experimental drinking and drug use. Um, I would say one of the most important messages is keeping the lines of communication open between parents and their kids, for kids never to have, have the fear of talking to their parents about things that are coming up for them in school and, and in life. Uh, that temptation of, hey, my friends are doing this. Um, and parents also educating the kids at the young age about that's going to happen. You're going to have kids coming to you that uh, are stealing alcohol from their parents or have the opportunity to try alcohol for the first time. And for a kid to be able to go to their parents and say, um, hey, my friends are doing this. Um, um, what should I do? And parents even telling them, hey, you're going to have kids that are coming to you that are going to ask you, hey, let's, let's drink, or hey, you want to have a beer, or you want to try this. And the important thing for kids to know is that um, there's no need to alter your mood or mind in any way using some other substance. Be comfortable in your own skin. Be comfortable who you are. Be strong enough to have that stance of, no, not today. Uh, I have no interest in doing that or, you know, teach kids the tools that they need.